Old Grognard says, Let's learn how Cyberpunk 2020 balances the power of cybernetics through humanity loss, empathy reduction, and cyberpsychosis. The idea for this video came about the other day when I was talking to my son and asked him if the Cyberpunk 2077 game had anything where you get penalties for having too much cyberware. And uh, he told me no. I thought, hmm, there might be some interest out there in the system Cyberpunk 2020 uses to do just that. So I got with old Dognard in the research department and we got to work. Let's look in the Cyberpunk 2020 rulebook and go to chapter 6 on page 72. In this chapter, one of the things it describes is how cyberware reduces a character's humanity score and in turn lowers their empathy stat and can eventually lead to cyberpsychosis. Before we go any further, it might be a good idea to define some things. Empathy is one of the stats that every character has in this game. It is used to do some of the things that Charisma does in other games. An unaugmented human has an empathy score between 2 and 10. Humanity, on the other hand, is a derived stat. It starts out as 10 times the character's empathy. So a character with a 7 empathy has 70 humanity. A 6 empathy, 60 humanity, you get the idea. When a character gets cyberware, it has a humanity cost associated with it. Here are some examples of the humanity costs for different cyberware. When a character gets cyberware implanted, we roll the humanity cost for the item and then subtract it from our current humanity. For every 10 points of humanity lost, the character's empathy stat goes down by 1. If the character's empathy stat reaches 0 as a result, they fall under the control of the referee and succumb to cyberpsychosis. Let's do an example to show how this works. Our example character's empathy stat is an 8. This means their starting humanity is 80. For whatever reason, they decide to get two cyber optics. Maybe it's the result of an injury, they might really want to see in the dark, or they just got tired of buying glasses. So we look and see that the humanity cost for a cyber optic is 2d6 each. We roll 2d6 for each of the optics to determine the humanity lost. The left one makes us lose 5 humanity, and the right one makes us lose 8. So we subtract those from the character's starting humanity. Our humanity is now 67. Because we lost 13 points of humanity, the character's empathy stat drops to a 7. Each eye can hold 4 mods. We'll use one of the mod slots in each eye to gain low light vision. The humanity cost per eye is 0.5. That's right, you can lose half a point of humanity. Together they equal 1 point lost our humanity stat drops to 66. Cyberware has a humanity cost of anywhere from half a point all the way up to 4d6. There are items in later source books with even higher costs. Since they all stack, it isn't hard to see how they might add up and get a character down to a fairly low empathy stat, or even zero if you don't care. There are rules for getting therapy and such to regain humanity, and they are also in Chapter 6. When I played, we never used them. Humanity cost was permanent. That gives us a brief, but hopefully easy enough to understand, introduction to how Cyberpunk 2020 balances cyberware by having it erode a character's humanity. If you've played this game and have any cool cyberware stories or just want to tell us about your Cyberpunk 2020 gameplay experience, leave a comment. If you've enjoyed this and maybe learned something, click the like button to let us know. Thanks for watching. Cat of True Seeing, and I wish you a wonderful rest of your day.